What's going on guys, Coach Stone Face here, and welcome back to, well I guess I say welcome back, but it's going to be a new segment. We are going to do Coach Picks Wednesdays. So, moving forward after today, so today I have some mystery tins here that I purchased from Walmart. They have four factory sealed packs, obviously we're looking for 1516 or 1617, it's not in the camera, 1617 Series 1. Um... I mean, I've seen a lot of these. I've had some of these in the past. It's unlikely. You're likely most likely going to get an MVP, Parkhurst, and some score. Uh, but that's just for the first couple. And you also get 10 cards with it. After today, the next Coach Wednes or Coach Picks Wednesdays, uh, I will be making these. So I'll make my own little mystery box here. Um, if I was going to do something like Gold Box or Boom Box, like some of those like mystery tins or mystery boxes you get, I'm going to make my own. So we'll see how they go. Hopefully they go over over well. We're probably going to get some repeat products in some of them. Uh, I might just buy a couple cases of, of different products to make up my tins. But, you know, for, for today, we're just going to go through what MJ Holdings gives us. So it looks like it's going to be four factory sealed packs. Uh, I'm going to tell you right now, I'm not going to open the score. Uh, plus 10 assorted cards. So look for mystery packs, seated one and two, or game used autograph cards, seated one and two. So again, seen a lot of these. Uh, I'm expecting very, very little from them. In fact, I would be surprised if we get any of our chase cards or packs. <clears throat> Trying to make some room here. Did not prepare for this properly. All right, so we'll open up the first one here. All right, it looks like we have our cards. Let's we'll dump this out. And just like I predicted... So we see it's empty now. But these tins are pretty much perfect for what I want to do with them. So uh, I'm excited to use those. We have MVP. Now it is hobby, which is nice. We have Parkhurst. Uh, this one has a beeper in it. And then two score packs here. I'm not going to open the score packs. Uh, I might open them if I get to <laughs> on my own. I'm running out of product. But we'll go through the base cards here that comes with it. I mean, really... There's not much. I don't even need to talk about them. Flurry for sure, Vegas. So, oh, we do have a jersey card here. Brad Stewart jersey card. Uh, and before I go on, I should say these cost, I think it was like 20 bucks at Walmart, give or take. Oh, Typically, they just give you a run of these, but these are all beat up anyway. All right, I'll put these over with my base cards to just get rid of. We'll open MVP last because I'm a big, ah, oh, you know what? With the beeper, we'll open up Park Curse last. That's 320 cards, kind of like OPG, where you're just going to get a bunch of random product. Random cards, random names they wouldn't normally get. All right, we have Corey Crawford base, James Neal, Victor Rask, and we have a Henrik Sedin NA, or level 1 NHL player credentials. It's a cool card there. Vasilevsky, Schwartz. Couturier and Nick Backstrom. I don't think any of those would be high hits. Although Vasilevsky would probably be now. Alright, and some base. So, this one does have a little beep beep in it. Making sure I don't steal these from good old Walmart. Hopefully that means we get a good name. These are... I don't even know what year. 2019-1920, so... I don't know who would be in this, whether whether you'd see a Kale McCarr or not. I don't know, but we'll go through it. Scotty Smith sticking together. Oh, there is a rookie of Max Verano. Pavelski, there's our Kucherov. Just a short print. And that's all they wrote. So nothing to write home about in the first one. Let's hope for better in the second. <clears throat> Which way is this one open? This way. All right, so there's our cards. Once again, we have MVP, score, is there anything underneath it? Score and Parkhurst. So, 
Parkhurst is going to be the new score for MJ Holdings, I think, where they're just going to get a ton of this product, and it's absolute garbage. But we have score and score. There's a beeper thing I maybe tested out, because I'm pretty sure this is... I don't know if score had. Had hobby. But 2012-2013 score. We have 1920 Parkhurst and 1718 MVP. So we'll go through the base here real quick see if there is anything mini jersey collection those are always pretty cool but the jerseys not the cards all right oh and we have a jersey card here of Hanu Toivinen Toivinen can't never say it properly so we have two jersey cards so far which are probably the best pulls and they are just the loose cards that they put into these packs all right well, once again, we'll start with Parkhurst this time. We started MVP last time. The little beeper got me excited that we might get something good. We, in fact, did not. All right. Mitch Marner base. As a Leafs fan, I'm okay with that. Nikita Gusev, rookie. We have Cam Atkinson, just... Parkhurst insert Mark Giordano current Maple Leaf Casper Kapanen current Pittsburgh Penguin alright nothing too crazy in Parkhurst let's see what we get in the MVP alright Mr. Linen Freddie the Anderson Nick Foligno, Marchand, and we have a silver script of Sebastian Ajo. And that's all she wrote. So there we go. Two tins down, and so far it has been what you'd expect. Pretty bad. So let's see what the third brings us. Alright, and it has... Oh, maybe something a little different. Here's our cards. Oh, there it is. We did get something. 2016-17 Series 1. Looks like retail. Let's see what else we have here. Alright, we have Parkhurst again. And then two packs of score. They must have bought the entire product run of score. MJ Holdings. And we, here we have a hanger, as well as a retail pack, it looks like. Get rid of those. So we'll do that one last. Obviously, we're, I mean, 15, 16 is obviously the better crop if you want your money's worth. As a Leafs fan, this is great. I mean, you have Matthews, you have Hyman, you have Nylander, you have the checklist. It's pretty cool. So I'm, I do have a Matthews canvas. And I have Canvas Young Guns and the Marner Young Guns, which is in Series 2. So I am looking for the Matthews and the Nylander um, original, or just base Young Guns. So there we go, Mini Jersey again. Prospects of Steve Maltes. Nothing crazy here. What is this, 91 score? Yeah, it's all the same. It's all the same garbage. Brandon Shanahan, Premier. All right, nothing crazy in that. More junk. <clears throat> All right, let's see what we get here in Parkers. So far, we haven't gotten, haven't received anything good. So let's see if that changes here. Let's say we got one of those like, oh, this one's a bolt. Okay, so we do have something good here. A prominent prospects of Kale McCarr. Kale McCarr, prominent prospects. That is a good name. Charlie McAvoy, I think that's... Second or third year. Second year, he sure. Frolik. There was a card sticking together here. Okay, there is another rookie. Uh, Tobias Bjornfoot. And behind the behind the Iron Man, Keith Yandel, is Tyson Berry on the Leafs. So, get rid of those. All right, prominent prospects. Kale McCarr. Not a bad little one there. Could this tin also come with a Austin Matthews Young Guns? 
I mean, obviously we know the answer is no, but we still hope and pray for the best. So it is retail. There are base packs, unfortunately, and I'm guessing it's what we're going to get. But let's find out. So we have Pavlik, Barkov, Brock Nelson, Jake Gardner, Andrew Hammond, Devin Dubnik. It looks like a base pack to me. Uh, just when you get that, because I think the tins of this goes for like almost 400 bucks now. So just looking, make sure I'm not missing anything. It is retail, so you're not expecting anything crazy. All right. Well, let's see if we have more MVP or if we can actually pull a McDavid or Matthews out of this one. My guess is MVP. And, oh, there we go. We do get another one uh, with more score. And another Parkhurst. All right. So score and score, exciting. Said no one ever. Might open up one just to look at the end. Oh, let's go through these first. All right. Again, these have been tragic, so I'm expecting much of the same. Oh, we have a Young Guns. Okay. Okay, we have a Drake Batherson Young Guns. It's not a bad one there at all. Is this 15? No, 18-19. 18-19, so we got Drake Batherson. So another good hit, to be honest. And that was just out of the loose cards. So out of the loose cards, we have two jerseys and a Young Guns. It's not too shabby if you think about it. All right. And we have a Parkhurst. Which pretty much have the best card we can get out of it. A prominent prospect like Kale McCarr. See if we can double up on it. Matthews base. So now we have Matthews and Nylander or Marner. I can't remember which one base. Okay, Dominic Kubelik. Young or young guns rookie. And Ryan Kessler Gold. And that's all. So moment of truth here. Are we gonna walk away with the Maple Leafs Young Gun? That is what I'm hoping for. Again, we are expecting a base pack. But we do hope for the best. And base pack. They have to weigh these or something. They're not going to put a young guns in these packs. There we go. Base. All right. Four tins. I'll be honest. I opened up a few off camera. So uh, I think I'm six tins in. I do have the other ones off camera are just MVP and Parkhurst. Nothing of those. So, unfortunately, we uh, we walked away without very much today. Not a great, not a great haul. Um, not that you expect too much, but I mean, I didn't know it was in these ones before I opened them on camera here, but, so, six tins, two packs of base, 16, 17, and that's all. That is all. The rest was either score parkers or a couple mvp packs so pretty frustrating with this product uh, i'm not gonna lie i know it's a mystery pack i know you gotta take the, the changes but when they market it the way they do you do expect a little bit more um so yeah that's a little little frustrating but we'll we'll take what we get and uh we'll we'll definitely move on uh, like they say we'll open up one of these let me open the oh is there a couple hangers yeah there's a couple hangers we'll just open up a hanger I think you can get autos in these, but I don't think they're they're very good. But you know what? We're just gonna do one to show you why you don't open this stuff, and then we'll we'll go on our way. So next Wednesday we will have a new mystery tin. It'll be coaches picks, and it will be a little bit different than than what these ones are. As I'm the one filling it up, I'm not selling them. They're not for reselling like that. They're just ones I'm making up to give myself a little bit more enjoyability. James Reimer. Rookie is Casey Sezikis. Season highlight for the Nuge. And then we saw the gold shifting on the back. So trash cards, trash inserts. We did give them a car, prominent prospects. So you got the Drake Batherson Young Guns. But other than that, it was a pretty 
upsetting and lonely opening. So I can't wait to see what we get in the next one. Hopefully it's something better. Until then, guys, take care, and I'll see you all soon.